Hello everyone and welcome to a new quick tip video from Spafire. My name is Thir Alatar and I'm lead data scientist in Spafire. I would like to talk today about our new document properties menu that we have added in Spafire 14. The menu can be accessed from view document properties. And this is a totally new designed uh, way of looking at document properties in addition to providing more functionality and then more information. So let's take, for example, here, this document property, uh, number of wells. You can see here the places where this uh, property is updated. We are updating the document property here from data function called selected wells. And then next to it, you can also see the number of places that this document is uh, currently used. So when you click on it, you can see that the document is used twice in this chart also used filter context menu just right here and for example if you decided to add another element that updates the document property so let's say uh, an input box inside a text area here and then and we can add an input field that updates the number of wells inside the text area and once you come here, if you click, you can see that uh, we have now text area added to the uh, places where uh, this document property gets updated. Even more, you can uh, do all the other functionalities that you can do from the uh, uh, normal document property dialog box. Um, you can edit value, you can uh, edit the document property. You can tie the document property to a script. And what's new here is that you can get the script from a local DXP file or from the DXP file in the library, or you can uh, write a totally new script using uh, uh, Iron Python. And you can also delete the document property. Uh, and you can also create a new document property from this dialog box. Uh, you can give the name, specify the type, and then give an initial uh, value. And you can also search among your document properties uh, here, so number of wells, for example. So this is uh, another way of looking at document properties. Hopefully you found that useful and stay tuned for our next quick tip video. Thank you.